Now, it's a daredevil activity usually considered a man's world, but one female pilot who competes in aerial acrobatics has managed to leave most of her male colleagues in her wake. Artiz Valeria Pajkova has the story. Head in the clouds and joy in the heart. Welcome to the world of the Siberian Angel. Svetlana Kapanina is a woman who can fly high, leaving men far behind. A page in the history book, she's earned 32 gold medals, including the title of the best pilot of the century. Nowadays there is nothing that men can do that women cannot. Everything's possible. Men's and women's pilots' programs are identical. When we fly, the judges don't care who is sitting in the cockpit, a man or a woman. Their marks are not gender-driven. Although many still imagine aerial acrobatics is a sport for men, the petite blonde disagrees as she keeps everyone on the edge of their seats. Svetlana's favorite sport aircraft is the highly maneuverable Russian-made Suhoi 26, said to be one of the best acrobatic planes in the world. This one-seated is normally flown by men, but six-time world champion in aerial acrobatics Svetlana Karpanina is an exception. To gain access to the control stick, Svetlana has to put several pillows on the back of her seat to gain extra height. Aerobatic flying subjects pilots to serious G-force that can result in loss of consciousness and vision. Russia's aerobatics team coach says even some military pilots who wanted to become members of the team found they just couldn't take it. In the last 30 years, I've taught dozens of students. Many of them became champions. You can describe Svetlana in many ways, but in a nutshell, she is a genius of aerial acrobatics. She is above all others, the only one in history. But the sky is not her limit. A mother of two kids, Svetlana is walking on air when it comes to spending time with her family. She's a fan of gymnastics and takes her kids to the gym twice a week. Both of them were airborne even before they were born, as Svetlana continued to fly for as long as she could. Her husband Vladimir, an instructor in martial arts, finds his courage failing when it comes to his wife and her daredevil career. Of course, I'm in terror of her life. I'm nervous. It's easier for me to go to war than to worry about her. And here she is, always alert in her cockpit, zigzagging across the sky. Russia's queen of the atmosphere. Valeria Bekova, RT, Moscow.